Hello, I'm Amir Akila from Centurion Modern Subject Control along with Cody, one of our senior instructors. Today we're going to be going over the outside wrist lock, a very, very versatile wrist lock that can be applied in a uh, live stand-up grappling situation or if the subject just latches onto you and is non-combative but non-compliant. The suspect reaches up, grabs your vest or tries to hang on to you, prevents you from getting into where you need to be to assist your partners. Um, what I'm going to do in this position, I'm keeping my shoulders up, my hands are up. That hand there is a threat. If he goes to swing, I'm just ready to defend there. I'm going to initiate the motion with my uh, support side. I'm going to collapse that, rip it and collapse it onto the back, onto the uh, trauma plate on my chest. Now the other hand comes in for support. Again, my shoulder is up, my chin's stuck. Still, I'm very cognizant of that hand. I'm going to generate a circular motion corkscrewing down into the ground. So I'm not just spinning in a circle, I'm spinning in a circle as I lower my altitude. My lead leg is the one that's going to be my uh, pivot, or my spin leg. My pivot leg is going to be my inside leg here. So as I maintain this relationship, which is the main objective of my arms, my arms just hold position, my arms are not executing the takedown. I maintain relationship with the hand and my chest. My left leg will spin in a circular fashion downwards. Getting the suspect all the way down. Good uh, point of reference for instructors that are teaching DT. Pinky goes over the shoulder. That's what's going to generate the pain compliance, which will want him to relieve the pressure by falling down. Again, I'll show you one more time here. Cody, let's do it from a different angle. Hands on here. I'm cognizant of that threat. This hand's coming and collapsing it here. Now when I'm ready, this hand will drop. Shoulder replaces my protection. I have this nice and tight. My lead leg spins in a circular fashion, not a linear, but a circular fashion, like I'm drawing a circle on the floor. And I lower my altitude. And we have the suspect down here. In the next video, we're going to be going over the rowing the boat technique to get the suspect prone for handcuffing.